What's up everyone, this is Autotalk as Tech, and there is so much going down right now with the signing services. So right now, Tweakbox, App Valley, and Ignition are all not working, and it's simply because of someone in the iOS community. So basically what's happening is if you realized every time you go to a signing service and go to install an application, it may install for like 15 minutes and work, and then it's not working anymore. So what's up with that? Why are your apps not working? Well, I will explain all of that in this video. So I just want to give a huge thanks to Apple Tech Video for helping me find this information. This dude's got an amazing YouTube channel, so go and check him out. I will link him down below in the description. So getting started with all the information that you guys need to know. Okay, so basically there's an individual in the iOS community who is basically taking a screenshot of the settings inside your iPhone. So you know how you go to settings, general, profiles, and device management. And then when you go to trust a certificate, whenever you install a third party application, the individual is taking taking a picture of that certificate name whenever Tweakbox or App Valley or Ignition signs an application or a bunch of applications using the same certificate. They take that name and they send it and report it to Apple. So what's basically happening is Apple receives this image and they say, thank you for your feedback and support. We will look further into this. And then sooner or later, you'll notice about 15 minutes or so the apps are no longer working. So you install an application, it might work, but then 15 minutes later, it doesn't work and everything will be down for like a full two hours. And then like Tweakbox, App Valley and Ignition, they get everything working again. And then another 15 minutes goes by and it's all down. So this is really significant because nothing is working. App Valley, Tweakbox and Ignition, they are spending thousands of dollars a day constantly trying to re-sign applications. It costs about $300 for a certificate. So all these big signing services are taking hours just to get these apps signed and then they're revoked within seconds. So this is a big deal. This has actually happened before in the iOS community. It happened about two years ago. There was a developer who wanted his application signed under a signing service and the signing service said no. And basically that developer ended up reporting all of these certificates that the signing service had to Apple and this fiasco basically happened two years ago. The only difference is this happened for a couple of days, whereas now this is happening for about four to five days straight and we do not know how long this is going to continue. So applications may continue to no longer be signed. We do not know if this individual would decide to stop because it's affecting a bunch of users. So we will see how this plays out. But long story short, if we want to see applications working again, this individual is going to have to stop doing this. I believe they're doing it for attention because the person in the community who was doing this had around five followers when they started this and they're now over 300 followers. I'm not going to say who it is, so I don't give any attention to them because they don't really deserve that. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you check out Apple Tech Video and as always, peace.